I think budgets are the worst. Budgets are the number one thing holding back most people from saving and making as much money as possible. I've always hated budgets. They've always scared me. I never wanted to do that type of deep dive. And I also think they reinforce a scarcity mindset. The entire personal finance industry tells you that you need to cut out your latte or that glass of wine. But it's often those small things that make us the happiest. Five or 10 or 20 or even $100 here or there, it's not gonna make or break you. The average American spends about 70% of their income on three expense categories, housing, transportation, and food. Instead of buying the biggest house that you can afford or get a mortgage on, buy something that's reasonable. If you're renting, rent out a couple of the extra rooms. Crashing with your parents for a while, crashing with your friends, Keep that housing expense as low as possible for as long as possible. I used to live in a $1,500 a month apartment and then I moved down to a $700 a month apartment. So I was saving about $800 extra per month. That's $9,600 a year. But when you invest that difference, just doing that for three years, I'm gonna be over $300,000 richer in 30 years. That's a huge amount of money. Don't buy a new car. It just doesn't make any sense financially. Buy the nicest used car that'll get you from point A to point B. Carpool if you can, use public transportation. Buying a new car, it's one of the worst financial decisions that you can make in your life. The $40,000 new car that you buy, if you invest that instead, that $40,000 car is gonna be worth $300,000 or more of invested money in 30 years. Americans don't spend as much money on food as they do transportation and housing, but food is one of those areas where there's a really high ROI to buying things in bulk, to finding the most affordable grocery store, and just being mindful. You don't have to go crazy cutting back your food expenses, but just don't eat out as much or order from delivery apps as much, and you'll be able to get that expense under control. Just keep housing, transportation, and food as low as possible, and then go out to that basketball game. Go grab beers with your friends. Go get that manicure, pedicure, because those are gonna be the things that make you happiest.